I just received my very first audition request. <laughs> no one expresses how weird and awkward this is. Like, what am I wearing? That was awkward. That was so awkward. have less than two hours to get ready and do all that I need to do before going ahead and meeting my friend for tonight. I'm gonna give you guys a little rundown as to what I'm doing while I'm getting ready. Gotta put sunscreen on always. Right now I am getting ready to make a slate shot for Actors Access. For those of you who don't know what Actors Access is, it's a casting website where you could submit yourself to auditions and where agents can also submit you for auditions. This is a site where every actor is on. It also gives you a whole overview of your resume and stuff so that casting directors can search you up and all that kind of stuff. Obviously it's very important to be part of these casting websites so that you can get auditions as well as also also made account on backstage as well. I just decided that it was finally time for me to do that since I did get my headshots recently. I think it's time to finally start auditioning, you know? And for those of you who are wondering, I am doing the same exact makeup as I did in my headshot vlog so if you want to go see that, I made a two-part headshot vlog. The first one was me getting ready and talking about the things that I'm bringing to the shoot and part two of the vlog was the actual shoot and that's where you got to meet my photographer and he got to give you guys some headshot tips as well. I'll link that video down below. I have to do the same exact makeup as I did in that video because I am relating it back to the headshot itself. If you're not familiar with how headshots and slate shots work on actors access or even know what a slate shot is, I will explain. So a slate shot is pretty much just you introducing yourself. It's just a seven second video of you saying, hi, my name is blank. And I'm making sure that I look exactly as I did in those headshots so I can make this slate as accurate as possible. And the reason that it is so important to make a slate shot for your actor's access is because it gives you an advantage when submitting to auditions. Pretty much if you have a slate shot on your actor's access account, your profile is automatically pushed to the top of the screen when casting directors are trying to cast their roles. So it's very important to have media attached to your profile just to give that advantage and it's easier for casting directors as well. Again, I have less than two hours. I'm going to go meet up with a friend. We're going to go eat and I think she's going to get some piercings done. So that's also really exciting. It's like almost 6 p.m. I'm supposed to meet her for 7.30. So I am trying my best to do as much as possible with the time that I have. It shouldn't be too long since, again, the slay shots are seven seconds, so it shouldn't take me that long. Set that one more time because we love setting spray. Cool. <sighs> Ugh, went in my mouth that time. And the last step is highlighter. Again, this is the Fenty Beauty highlighter. We love her. Okay. I think we're good. I also just washed my hair, so... It dries very fast. I'm going to set up the area to film and then I'll check back with you in a bit. Okay, so I changed into the shirt that I was wearing in my headshot and this one was actually with contacts, so I'm going to not use my glasses, obviously. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. That was so awkward. Why is this so awkward? Okay, hold on. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. That was awkward. That was so awkward. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. That's weird. You see, no one expresses how weird and awkward this is. Like, I can feel the secondhand embarrassment coming from you guys alone. Like, I'm gonna check these takes before I switch into my new outfit. Hold on. They're good enough. Okay. Okay, now I'm changed into my business attire outfit. And this is what we are replicating. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. Doing a smile at the end is so funny. Oh my god. Oh my god, y'all. If you could see me right now, you would actually laugh at me. Like, what am I wearing? <laughs> uh, thank god for self-tapes. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. I'm saying my name so much, it almost doesn't feel like my name. Okay, I think we're good. I'm going to change into normal clothes now, and I will check back with you when we are submitting the slate. Just so you guys know, this is how many takes it took, just for a seven second clip. Full transparency here. <laughs> okay, so after a few very long minutes, I finally figured out which clips to use, but they aren't seven seconds long. They're like two seconds, so I don't know how Actors Access is going to react to me having two second long videos, but we will see together. I'm going to show you exactly how I'm going to input the slate shot for those of you who are wondering. These are my two free headshots that Actors Access allows to place on the site, and all I'm going to do here is add slate shot. I'm going to open that up. 
hopefully it works okay upload i'm hoping this is good or else i'm gonna have to redo everything again and i have no time to that <gasps> did it work hi my name is kayla carvalho okay so obviously again actress access allows one free slate shot everything after that is you have to pay i think five dollars us which is around six seven dollars canadian now for this one is obviously going to be paid so i'm going to add a slate shot from what I've seen, it's really important to make a slate shot per photo that you have on Actors Access just so again it pushes your profile to the top of the screen and it also just gives, as it literally says here, a seven second video clip that brings your headshots to life. Beautiful! Okay, so again, this is how Actors Access uh, profile headshots look. So when you press on the headshot. Hi, my name is Kayla Carvalho. Whoa, that's so weird and fun at the same time. I completely forgot to mute the background noise. It's not that terrible to the point where I have to change it yet, but eventually I will just mute the background. So make sure in iMovie or whatever editing software you use, you do remove the background noise. So now I have to get ready because I'm meeting my friend in less than an hour. So I'm gonna go get ready and I'll see you guys in a bit. Hi guys, so I'm with my friend Darlene and she ah. just got her three piercings done. She's in so much pain <laughs> now. I was telling her, I was like, the belly button healing process is worse than the actual piercing itself. Yeah, like it's sore. <laughs> and I don't want to bend. She doesn't even, she doesn't even want to drive out of here. She's like, let's just stay. <laughs> let's just get Kayla to drive for me. <laughs> Yeah, Kayla, who doesn't have a full license yet, but... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we plan on going to this mango dessert place, so whenever oh, she yeah. feels comfortable... I can't bend! I can't bend! I can't bend! Uh, we will head out there, and then we'll let you guys know how it is. Alright, see you. <laughs> okay, hello. So, we got our mango dessert. Looking yummy. <laughs> and this is going to be Darlene's first reaction. Yeah, first we, time having this. We did go to a mango place like a while back, so I want to see if she likes this one. I'm so scared I'm going to drop this. It's a lot. Like, they fill it up, man. Look at that. Also, we're in a parking lot right now, so that's why there's so many lights going on. Smells like mango, as expected. <laughs> I would hope so. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Wait, what do I grab first? <laughs> there's I know, so there's so much going on. In here. I know. I'm going to grab these chewy looking balls. They're so good. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. I like it. Mmm. -hmm. Nice and chewy. <laughs> Dude, it's so good. That's pretty good. Like, their mangoes are good. I rate it. Yeah? I rate it 1 to 10. Hold on, I only had the chewy balls. <laughs> Wait, why is this so huge? Oh, the mango chunk, I know. Here, right? let me show. Look how huge. That's a chunk of mango. Mmm. Mmm. Mango just hits the spot, man. Oh, we're matching. I didn't even notice. The leather. Hey. <laughs> it's a leather vibe type of day, you know? Yes. I'm gonna rate it. Yeah, one to ten. Like an eight. That's good. That's good. It's pretty good. Yeah. I like the other one the better. The other one's good. The other one has I more stuff. There, though. Yeah. Yeah. I can't complain about this. It's pretty good, though. Right? Anyways, we're gonna finish off eating, and then I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye. You guys. <laughs> I'm... I have no words. Okay, hold on. Let me fill you guys in. I just received my very first audition request. <laughs> oh my god! And to make it even better, I have three auditions to film today. What is my life right now? <laughs> I'm just over the moon. I, you can see, I'm just so happy right now. This is so crazy. This is so crazy. And it's funny because literally yesterday, I posted a TikTok about finally being able to submit myself to things and how everything is finally starting for me and how things are finally working out for me and then I wake up today with two emails from the casting director requesting for an audition for both of the commercials that I submitted to and the third audition is actually one that's an open call I found it and that's also what I'm gonna do today <laughs> can you tell I'm excited because this is unreal it's it's so crazy to think that all of that I've been working towards, all of the training, even though it's just an audition, like you guys may be seeing this and like, Kayla, like it's just an audition doesn't even mean that you're gonna get it. I understand that and I'm fully aware of that, but I'm still so happy and I'm so grateful to be where I am today, to be able to say that I've trained and I have worked this last year and a half and then I'm finally ready to audition and to actually film things now this is crazy so yeah with all that being said i got ready i am just gonna change into the outfit and we're gonna film these auditions this is crazy so yeah let's get started <laughs> So the 
this is the setup. Obviously, I'm going to leave a little bit of headroom and I am wearing a sports bra because the first self tape that I am filming is for the role of a gym goer, hence <laughs> the gym wear. I'm just pulling up the audition instructions and it's really important to read every single thing that they are wanting out of you. So I need two headshots, I need to say the role I applied for, my full name, where I'm located, and then that's it. <laughs> Pretty simple. Also, I think I'm gonna do a clip of me putting my hair back because obviously you're at the gym, you put your hair up. Just to also just let them know how I look with my hair up since I don't have any headshots with that. Honestly, they didn't ask for a clip of my hair up, so hoping that they see that and they're like, oh, that was a good idea. It's a good thing she did that. I like her. That's what, that's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> The next one is from the same brand. It's from the same casting director. It was just a background role. The one I just did was a lead role. So it's the same exact layout as the first audition. However, I'm going to do this one with glasses just so they can see me, I guess, in a different lens. So this take, well, sorry. This take, I'm actually going to wear the shirt that I used in my headshot for the previous submission. And the reason I'm doing it for this submission is so that they can remember me from the previous headshot so that I'm still on their head, you know? I have no clue if that's actually real or if that even works, but that's just how my mind processes it. So we're gonna do it. I'm so excited. This is going so well. Okay, cool. We just got through those two real quick. Let's get on to our third audition. I don't think I even explained what the first audition was about. So sorry about that. I got way too excited. I auditioned or I submitted myself through Actors Access itself and that's why I got the email that said I could do my audition today. For this next audition, an open call. It's just something I found on TikTok. This brand casts people who aren't professional actors, models, or anything. They just want real people. And so because I haven't had professional experience on camera, I'm eligible to audition for this. This one is really exciting as well. I think I'm going to stick with this shirt. What I wear during this next audition doesn't really matter because actually, hmm. Maybe it does, but this one I don't really have to be super formal or wear the same outfit as I did with my headshot, but I might just do that just so it's cohesive and just so that they remember me. So I have the casting on my phone. Experience posting video social media platforms such as TikTok, YouTube, Instagram is a bonus but not mandatory. So I'm definitely going to speak on behalf of my YouTube channel. That's why it's so good to read instructions because something may actually be working out for you. So I just filmed it and I did not stutter but kind of not use the right words all the time but I honestly feel like that gives a lot more personality than being very uniform so that is the take I'm gonna go with. That's it. I just did all three of my auditions. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. I'm gonna go and edit all of this and I'll check back with you in a bit. I still don't really like understand or I'm comprehending that's actually happening but it's happened and I'm super excited and I'm gonna go submit it now. So. Okay, update. I just submitted all three auditions and I now understand what people mean by it's hard to let go of the thought of the audition afterwards because you're just so excited. Like I'm still on such a high, I'm still so excited and all I can think about is when I'm gonna get a response and all this kind of stuff and I'm just hyper fixating on it and I find I, I'm, I'm catching it. I'm catching on to what I'm thinking and I want to put a stop to that and that's one of the biggest things in the industry that I have to practice because it's so important to let go after your audition. Whatever happens happens. If it's meant for me, it will be mine. I don't have to worry about it. I did all that I can and I'm very happy with what I submitted. So all I have to do now is just let it go, get it out of my head and distract myself. But I'm going to end this vlog here. I did not expect this to happen. I didn't know that I was going to have an audition so soon so this was a spur of the moment thing but I'm actually really really happy with how it went and I hope you guys enjoyed and many more to come for sure and I will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching bye guys